first off say hope you're having a great summer uh, it is very very hot in the Midwest and other parts of the country is very 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 hot I think it was like uh, might have been heat indices of over a hundred or something like that and it's just a different kind of heat you're like whoo this is really hot so to kind of stay cool just kind of made sure I have my natural fibers on and everything uh, my cotton and my model, model and uh, to, and the day I decided to wear uh, my French Parisian uh, out in the bistro kind of handbag today. So uh, I wanted to do an unboxing. So uh, the clue will be it's very equestrian. So stay tuned. It don't matter. Oh, I was kind of listening to a little the clean version of Drake. Uh, so yeah, that was kind of in my in my head a little bit, you know. Anyway, <laughs> anyway, um, this is an unboxing. So I got it yesterday. I haven't opened it up. You know, it's still all sealed and everything. So it's not like I'm up here trying to fake it or anything like that. So let's open it up. So I. I really like the bag. I thought the bag looked really cool. Uh, the, the one of the clues that I gave was that it was it's very equestrian. Um, also, uh, it, it's very Italian. That's another clue. And also, it's a it's the kind of bag that you could wear all year long. It's not any kind of you know. It's not like you know summer, you know spring. You can wear it all year long. And Here's the, here's the little receipt, and actually the bag is, actually it's in plastic and everything, and it is, it is the, it's in it, I got it in, it got this bag in, in Espresso, and it's, it, the bag is called, let me just make sure I have it right, it's the Florentine Toscana Front Stitch Hobo, and this Hobo retails, like the retail price was $4.28. The Dooney and Burke website had the uh, handbag on sale for $1.99, but I Love Dooney, I actually got an uh, email from I Love Dooney and they actually had a 25% coupon, so I actually was able to get the handbag for $171.20, so that was an awesome deal. Uh, so I said, oh, this is really, really nice, because it's, it's and, I, and this is a color that I don't have. So, let me open it up. And I, so I'm opening it, taking it out the plastic and everything. And I really, I uh, think this bag was first introduced. I really see how they put the foam on the, on, on the little part of the the decoration here it had a little foam in there uh, I do I do like um, I mean I can't truly say I know I've noticed see that it has a little protective cover there so I really like how they uh, actually make sure that the bag uh, is fully I mean all this protection in it is just great I really like that uh, sometimes you're like to say, oh, it's all this paper, but I really like that. I really like that it has that in it. And so I'm going to take all that out. And that's the silica gel, which is a protective uh, during uh, as it's being uh, delivered. Making sure all that's in there. And actually there is the dust bag. Taking more of that out. And even a little paper around the, the dog leash for the keychain. Take that out. And then I will, let me take this off here. And it really attracted me. I really liked the color because it was a color that I didn't have. I, as you know, I really like pink. And I really like, uh, I recently, I had uh, got the... Uh, Toscana, uh, Toscana bag in ginger, which was nice, and 
me move the I mean the bag box over here. And that'll show you it's the the inside of the bag is leather. So there's a there's a front pocket here and then there's a pocket here and then there's a zip zipper zipper compartment pocket zipper pocket here and then there's the the, the registration it says it's a hundred percent genuine leather a hundred percent genuine leather is the body the trim is a hundred percent leather the lining is a hundred percent genuine leather and then it says the pockets are a hundred percent nylon and this is the protective the registration cord and uh, and I really I really like that it's very soft in there uh, the bag had great reviews I think it was like 4.8 reviews on there um, it had great reviews I'm leaving it leaving that on right now but let me take this I can take that off right quick to show you how that looks take there so when I saw this bag I was like because you you know I, one thing I one word of advice I have is that you never just want to buy a bag just because it's on sale you I mean it's great that it's on sale but you also want to make sure that the bag uh, looks you know it's something that you really want like for example I have I have really nothing in this bag and it's really holding it's holding its shape very well. It's holding its shape very well. And I really like how like I can put it under under my under my arm. I can kind of show how that looks. I can put it under my arm and it looks really nice under my arm. It's really a nice just a nice a nice bag. Just really a nice bag. I really like it. And uh, I really like the color too. It's a nice espresso really pretty color it's a really and it's see you can see all the zipper the the not the zipper but the trim compartment and the so the sewing the top stitching along the the handle along the shoulder uh, along the front of the front flap and you know there's actually you can either do it like that or you can put it in and on here it says Dooney and Burke 19 Dooney and Burke 1975 and just a little more information just to give you on the bag is let me put this in here it's a rich european leather and hardware meets elegant equestrian styling equestrian see i told you equestrian uh in our florentine toscana collection this chic bag is the perfect complement for everything from the work day to the weekend with its unique silhouette, lightweight body, timeless top handle, silver palladium hardware, and perfectly craft, crafted surface. And one thing also I liked about the, the the care and the cleaning of this is that this bag and the other Toscana bag I have from the collection, it does not require any cleaning or anything like that. If you need to wipe off, like with a, with a cloth or something, even if rain gets on it, it you do not need to put any kind of like polishes or anything like that on it because if you do that you don't want to damage your bag so i wanted to to share this with you because i really thought it was really a pretty bag and i really like that um i like that it, it just gives a real elegant look to it 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 uh it, it really looks even more to me than than the 428 what it originated for is the cost and I really just like how it just really just you can see the kind of the suede on the inside too and it's just really a nice bag that you could wear in so many different I mean really it, it's so true from uh, work day to weekend so um, until next time this is JT Wisdom and uh, be elegant be graceful and be you and if you have not subscribed please subscribe uh, there's the button below and if you'd like to receive notifications when I do um, you know, upload videos then the notification bell is right next to it and just make sure you check that so until next time this is JT Wisdom and Jesus loves you